today we will see uh, how to remember uh, free cash flow to the firm and free cash flow to the equity formulas there are somewhat confusing to remember all these uh, around eight nine formulas are there equations are there so we'll see how to remember these eight equations simply uh, by using a uh, few uh, short equations we can say let's see uh, these are the eight equations uh, we come across in cfa level two even in other finance related uh, subjects so free cash flow to the firm and uh, cash flow from from offer operations and fixed capital investment interest and uh, tax rate and net borrowing and free cash flow to the equity and net borrowing and the ni net income ebitda and the depreciation all these things like if you arrange these all uh, eight equations in somewhat different uh, set of equations then you can easily derive all these eight equations from those small equations okay try here you can see that abc like uh, free cash flow to the firm and free cash flow to the equity and the cash flow from operations yeah these are k is just a constant like uh, these are these constants are particularly uh, same for the all three three equations okay just remember these k is constant for only these three equations and here the small abcd is these are the uh, uh, equations or formulas which we can use we can substitute in those uh, top three equations okay to derive uh, these eight equations so we'll see how we can use them to derive these equations okay yeah this one this is the list of all eight equations and on this right side we had shown that which these equations can be used to derive this equation one okay so these if you uh, use these two equations like if you subtract one from another equation then we will get to the this equation okay in this way same way this way, these two equation if you use we can get this equation if you use these two the equations we can get this equation and if you want to get this equation like we have to substitute this uh, cash flow from operations to in the first equation so we can get this fourth one also in same way all equation we can derive using only these seven small short formulas and here if you observe like how these two are related how this constant is representing of these three equations then it is a like very uh, somewhat interesting thing we can uh, derive from these three equations and i will show you those three in next video okay and just thank you so much goodbye